I grew up in a rural community. Uh, I, I want rural communities to continue to be successful. And my goal in the world is to provide affordable, reliable electricity to people who live in areas like I grew up in. I'm 100% fully supportive of the advancement of trying to figure out different technologies. You want to be more efficient in the use of the resources we have, regardless of what they are, right? And I think the real debate ought to be, if what we're worried about is putting emissions into the atmosphere, then let's have a conversation about putting emissions in the atmosphere, not what's the fuel choices, because fundamentally, if the fuel choices drive us to do things like mine in foreign countries who have poor practices, or it forces us to expose ourselves from a national security perspective to a single fuel type or a limited fuel type, uh, or you think about natural gas starts being traded worldwide, you're in a position now that you're competing with the rest of the world for a commodity to keep your lights on. I view Tundra really m more globally as the opportunity uh, to continue to use uh, fossil-based resources, but not put emissions into the atmosphere. I know there are times when people look at why are we doing stuff with CO2 and half of our load is in the state of Minnesota. And right now, uh, by 2040, 100% of the deliveries to Minnesota uh, need to have the ability to at least say you've offset uh, the CO2 uh, for all those deliveries, right? That's real and live and in front of us. And so if you tell me that my compliance mechanism is to produce 24 hour electricity, seven days a week, 365 days a year, and represent that it's carbon free for one half of the electric deliveries I'm responsible for, I'm gonna find a way to do that. And so we have a great group of employees at the Young Station and in Grand Forks, um, who I think they understand that you know, our job is to figure out how do we kind of cost effectively use the resources on behalf of our membership. We figure stuff out in this country about how to do it differently, how to do it better, how to make it work. Our industry is not without challenges today, but reality is as long as we can continue uh, to provide cost-effective electricity that's reliable and affordable uh, and, and we can figure out how to do that in an ever-changing world around carbon management, uh, I believe you have a bright future. Yeah, I guess people could say it's a job. Yeah, I get paid to do what I do. Obviously, we all do. Um, but I think fundamentally it's because it's the right thing to do. It's, we're driven by making sure we can give back and this is a great way to be able to get back and provide those basic needs that people have, which allow them to be more successful as well. I am Mac McLennan, I'm the president and CEO of Memcota Power Cooperative, and I am Lignite.